right, uh, we're back again, day 28, alpha 19.2 experimental. So I've adjusted my house slightly, got a little bit of work done, put my bed up here. Um, that layout's still basically the same, nothing has changed. I still have to upgrade all this in here, but uh, the walls are upgraded now to uh, reinforce concrete. They were mostly where before. Replace this with a door. Um, and I'm working on getting a, a proper horde base set up out here. So let's close the door for now. We're going to head over to the old horde base, which we're going to keep running, I think, probably for a couple more hordes anyway. So this is all updated. I'm still working on that. I want to replace all this in here. I'm going to add some plates and stuff around here so the zombies can't get into the inside. And then I'll be adding a balcony out here, probably on both on all four sides anyway. So we can see down. And I really haven't decided what I want to do with this horde, horde base yet. Um, I mean, I'm going to have a look at it. It's not going to be structurally the best horde base, but it'll look nice. Uh, we'll see how it goes. It's mostly going to be melee. Um, I've got an SMG and a shotgun turret now. I bought both of them. Um, I got a motorcycle, which I purchased. I managed to clear all this out. Now, I didn't upgrade all of this stuff here. Um, I put plates around, as you can see, all the way around the outside, because they were hitting on this last time fairly well. Uh, but it's all reinforced concrete behind there, so I think we'll be fine. Uh, the turret's still the same, so let's get up here. Alright, we'll close this up. Jump across. Alrighty. So this base, um, I updated a few of the blocks, but not much. I repaired all this stuff. We need to get our, uh, get this down, make sure we have everything here. Forged iron, reinforced, or sorry, concrete, um, some rebar frame blocks, cobblestone if we need it. Uh, some iron if we need to make stuff. I don't think we will. Extra band-aids. I'm going to take vitamins tonight, and I brought a splint with me just in case I get hit in the legs. Uh, got a level 5 bat now, and we've got the fortifying grip mod in case we drop below 50% health. Actually, you know what? I'm going to switch this out. I've got the stamina. Yeah, we've got the herb ergonomic grip on this one, so let's go ahead and take that off, because that'll reduce my melee uh, stamina use by a fair bit here. So this one, yeah, when health is below 50% gain in one hit point every five seconds, which can be useful if you're running around, but dropping the melee stamina use by 10%, we'll take that. And, um, yeah. Uh, shotgun, I made, I made, I uh, went, bit the bullet, went ahead and bought a, uh, or a, uh, made a, um, shotgun with the steel I had. It's only got seven rounds, um, I don't have a barrel extender, unfortunately, but this is really the backup weapon for spider monkeys or whatever else. Um, and we got tons of rounds for this. This is modified with rad remover, shotgun choke mob. I, I threw the two times scope on here. We're not going to use it, but I just wanted the extra damage. 17 damage per pellet, 10 pellets, 170 damage if we hit with at point blank. So that we got a uh, marksman rifle that I picked up. Uh, we found that, so we, we, we can use this if we need to. Right, just shoot the guys down here if we have to. I, I don't foresee needing it. It's got a clip extender on it. So we got like, what, nine rounds? Seven rounds? Okay, not bad. We've got the 44 if we need it. Molotovs, pipe bombs. Um, this is in case we set ourselves on fire. Put this on the uh, on the tool bench, tool belt tonight. Um, gonna have to watch the bars. And I think other than that, we've got, our, we've got XP goggles now. Uh, nerdy glasses, so we get 10% XP gain. And as far as our gear goes, I mean, we're not really kitted out the best, but I mean, we've got enough. I found the boots, I made the leg armor and chest armor. I'm still looking for the military armor schematic and the, um, I'm looking for the steel tool schematic and I'm also looking for the uh, forge, either schematic or, uh, sorry, the crucible schematic or the uh, actual crucible. I've been traveling around the map uh, I found a whole bunch of the traders. So we knew about Trader Jen down here and Trader Bob over here. Those are the ones I found via quest. I drove up here, found Trader Rec, Tra Trader Hugh, and there's another Bob down here. And then I can't remember who this guy was. I think it's another Rec down here. So I found a few of them. We found the uh, the Wasteland Biome too, which, you know, whatever. I still haven't found the Desert of the Snow Biome. I'm sure if I travel enough, I'll find them. But I've been just staying on the roads uh, with the with the motorcycle because some of this area, like going through here, is just a nightmare to try and get through. So yeah, that's it. And we got the horde in what, at 45 minutes. So I, I'm really prepared. I'm gonna go with the uh, bat most of tonight, I think, if I can. I didn't change this layout. I don't know why. I just 
I'm leaving it for now. My the new horde base isn't not gonna it's not gonna be like this. I'm gonna incorporate shotgun turrets. I think I've also got like somewhere around 17 uh, electrical fences, something like that. So let's have a look at skills and game stage before we start. So skills, perception, I haven't added anything to perception. Strength is where it's all at. We've got a cigar now, so I was able to add extra. I saved me two skill points for this, so got boomstick up to four. Uh, so we got shotgun master. We should be shredding people with the shotgun tonight. Pummel Pete, we got it to level four. Sex Rex, we maxed out. Still haven't top topped these guys up yet, but that's coming up. Master Chef, um, number two. We didn't actually eat, but uh, I should have probably done that before we left. I got time. Oh, hey, what's up? And about a swing. Yeah, I'm, I'm shocked I actually didn't bring food. Uh, let's quickly go get that. Um, anyway, yeah, so as far as the other skills go, I haven't really added anything to, to anywhere except for better barter. I got that up to rank 3 because it gives you... Uh, the trader shows more stuff in their... Uh, um, just gonna go ahead and use this. Show us more stuff in their secret stash, and use that. I think that should be enough for tonight. Uh, yo, all right, let's go. Um, so yeah, that you know the trader shows more in his secret stash. That's the ominous trader Jones is now closed. Warning, horde's about to start. Um, yeah. So as far as skills go, like I said, really haven't added that much. Oh, come on. There we go. Yeah. Can make that jump. Beautiful. Zeds can't, but I can. All right. Now, uh, skills. Uh, yeah, intellect. We got it six now because of the goggles on, but better barter here. Advanced engineering at two. Attribute agility. I got light armor up a little bit, and we got hidden strike up a bit for when I'm going through POIs, but that's it. And then game stage 82. Really? Come on, buddy. Where are you? All right, a little bit of a slow start here. Still 16 zombies. Also, still on warrior. I expect to be going all night with this, so... Yeah, they're still getting a piece of me through these bars. I know Glock 9's got a very similar setup in his, uh... We got a guy down here, eh? Oh, she got a piece of me. Kenny's having a hard time figuring out where, where to attack me from. Come on, you guys. I'm right here. Ooh. Getting a little bit better with the swings here. Finally getting some timing on this. Ah, he didn't move forward. Finally getting some timing that I missed, of course. The drop down is kind of nice because it doesn't let them sit right at the bars. But then you get idiots like this, right? Come on. Come on, just punt the dog. Come on, you guys. Ooh. Okay, it's time to check these bars, I think. 
Okay, so not so bad. I'm not giving him too much of a chance to actually hit the bars. Yeah, they're doing some work down there too, eh? Oh, another bird. Got him? Alright, nice. Alright, let's drop some fire on these guys. Get off my base. Oh, he was a, uh... I'm shocked that these guys don't jump up behind me. I like the shotgun choke mod because it really narrows the, the field of shot. And if you've got guys coming at you straight like this, you're applying more damage to them straight on rather than spreading it around. I haven't been buying ammo. I've been making all my ammo. And then plus whatever I get from my quest rewards. And then finding it, of course. I found a fair bit. It doesn't seem like you get a lot in a... Uh, in treasure. Like you find like, you know, a half a dozen here, half a dozen there. But after a while it adds up. Ah, oh, shoot. So I got the M60 schematic. Found, I got. I, I think I bought that book. I bought a few books now. Damn you! So where is that? That's not. Oh, that's that. The dog paused there for a second. He's like, ah, I don't know if I want to go up there. Yeah, that uh, junk turret makes melee bases so worth it. And if this was eight zombies, this would be so much easier, but it's like, I like the 16 because it's just enough of a challenge, you know? If it was 32, we'd definitely be in a lot of trouble. They'd have bit broken through here a long time ago. I'd be going shotgun, I think, all night if I had to. Don't. Hit the blocks. Alright, let's set some fire down here. Haven't got any cops yet. Waiting for that spider monkey to come back. Did not mean to do that. Oh. Earn you bastards. Hello. Yes, these guys are burning out, some of them. Oh, shoot. Shotgun choke for the win. Yep, I'm down a bit of hit points here. That spider monkey down there. Where is he? There he is. Oh, we got our first soldier. Ah. Oh. Cop rubbing his groin in my face. Well, I don't know if I get hit by a spider monkey or what, but let's go ahead and use one of these guys. I haven't needed the uh, coffee tonight.
It's that mod in the bat and the extra little bit of, uh... And the extra little bit I got from the, uh, the, the uh, level up. Everything changes. Probably fixed this block, too. That guy was a bit of a burnout. <laughs> Get it? Burnout? <laughs> ah, I'm so funny. <laughs> that guy pop tarting. Die. Oh, another cop. Fucking shred these guys with a shotgun up here. It's crazy. All right. Stop banging on shiz down there. Come and get me. I don't know how it will be smoother. I think maybe the the stairs. If I made them too wide, maybe? I don't know. Ooh, somebody hit me from the side. At least my leg's not broken. Hers is, though. Oh, friggin' spider monkeys. These guys do all the damage. They can reach right through the damn bars. Not only is the jumping bad, it's just the, uh... The reach through the bars. It's just... can be horrific. You always gotta be watching for them. Especially with that lower, uh... Lowered block. I can't see them that well. into that. Look at this spider monkey. I don't know where you're who you're standing on it. I didn't even bring all my shotgun ammo either. Come on, buddy, over here. I've had to re repair those bars, what, three times now? I think it was three times. Yeah, barely any damage. Oops. Ooh! I don't know how I can make that better. Like, if I'm going to keep the drop down... I thought about having that an angle block there. I don't know, then I think it, the swing would be a little harder. Oh, friggin' spider monkey. Yeah, they're getting shredded. Oops. Come on, you guys. Yeah, see, she got a piece of me. It's only fair, though. Like, I mean... I'd love to go a horde night like this where I don't get hit. But... I don't know. I kind of like the... Uh, the worry about, you know, there's the possibility of if I'm not watching to get killed. Like my Kempri series at the end there where I died those times, it's like, you know, having the fear of death.
All right, I got an hour and a half left. I don't know what I'd do if I got swarmed by vultures. Like, I don't know. I think I'm pretty safe up here from vultures. Where did I get? Oh, I got a book. And I got hit. I got hit from my troubles. Ooh, took your head off. They're going for a push here. He's like, no, 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 no. Okay. He's, he's like, I don't know if I want to do that. There you go. Enjoy that, guys. Yeah, I think taking this post down here too helped. Stop hitting my walls. Gives me a second to fix a couple of these things here. Oh, they almost got through that. I'm on it right here, guys. Yeah, they just can't, uh... The pathing is difficult for them if I'm back. Because they can't hit me, so they're like, I don't know, if I can't hit them, like, I don't know what to do, right? Which I think is good. Like, the AI is a little bit smarter and a little bit stupider, I think. I think you can play them with a with a smart base a lot easier than you could in the past. But like with a legit smart base, and I don't mean like let's better use one of these again. I don't mean like one of those cheat bases where you use the angle blocks, which you can't do anymore. Oh, okay, they're clustering up again. They broke a block. Oh, this turret took her head off. Come on, you guys. Oh, you paused. You... I see, your friend died. You paused and your friend got killed. Getting a little bit of lag. Okay, it's coming to the end of the night. I think that's probably why. Same thing happened last time. I wonder if it's the sunrise that's doing it. Come on, you guys. I should have checked... I didn't check how many zombies kills we were at before, and I know I know I'll see it when I when I edit the video. But I have no idea how many kills. I, if you guys saw it, you'll know how many kills we got tonight. But the last horde night, we had we got a couple of hundred kills. Yeah, it's getting laggy. I don't care. I'm used to this kind of lag with uh, the. Uh, Nitrogen map generators. I get lots of lag after a day. I'm not exactly sure why that is. Come on, I want more XP. I mean, we could have probably gone with the shotgun all night and got a ton more XP than we did. I gotta find a barrel extender mod and I gotta make another shotgun. Oh, we got a hurt arm here. I think I'm going to put a couple points into physician. There we go. There you monkey. I've been encountering runners in buildings. Ooh, you got a piece of me. I haven't had a problem dealing with them in a, with a bat. As long as it's one of them, it's usually two hits and they're down. And then a finishing power attack to the head usually does them in. I think my attacks are slower because of uh, my arm here. And I'm thirsty. Let's go ahead and use this. Uh, what do I need for that? I'll figure it out in a second. Come on, you guys. Yeah, my, my attacks are really slow now. Finish this horde up. Yeah, attacks are real slow. I think I'm taking damage every time I swing, too. Looks like it. Uh, so... What is it here? 
Don't break my base. Sprained arm. Uh, this will take some time to heal, so I can't actually do anything about it, huh? Don't know if this is the last guy, but... Hey! Alright, let's go down. Check our bags out here. Yeah, so that arm there at the end, that was my fault for keep for continuing to swing. I should have not done that. Didn't really realize I was taking damage with every swing. Alright, more friggin' motor tool parts. I got so many of those now. Just can't find any schematics. Ah, I'm overdue. Okay, let's uh, overweight him here. Let's use this. Scrap that. Um, okay, we can sell those. Oh crap, so much stuff here. Um, let's just go ahead and do four of these despawn. Didn't use the skull crushers again either. Didn't feel like I needed them. Oh, I got a ratchet. More steel weapon or steel club parts, which is nice. I got a bunch at home. All right, so oh, we got a bag hiding in here. More ammo and nothing back there. All right, so what do we get here? A uh, book that we know already. Tempered blade mod we can sell. We can scrap this. More steel tool parts. So we got a ratchet. That's nice. We're still working with a level 2 wrench. So we're going to use the ratchet from now on. Two more of these. Uh, lamb, chicken soup. Some coins. That's nice. A bunch of coins. Yeah, so we're going to have some good stuff to sell. Going to be going around seeing what seeing the traders, see if I can find a, uh, a crucible, I think, between the net, this uh, Horde Knight and the next one. Um, Alright, we've got a few things that we can bring into here. Alright, so I'm going to end this here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to go inside with my broken arm and get things fixed up and uh, get stuff repaired. I'm going to come back next time. Well, hopefully this next base will be done. If it's not done, if I haven't really figured out what I want to do with it yet, if it's not done, we're going to go back in here. Because until Radiant, I mean, even, like, the damage was so minimal. <laughs> again. It's like I could do that again. I, I don't know. Until Demolishers show up, I think. And even when they show up, I don't know if the, uh... I think the, the problem will come if, if the, uh... The robotic sledge hits a, hits a Demolisher's button. That'll be a big deal, but... Other than that, I think we might be all right. All right, so I'll see you next time.